Hey, yo, you guys online? Yeah, dude, we're all online. All right, man, I'm hopping on. All right, I'm here. Hey, what's up, man? We're all here. Hey, look what I just found. Is that a golden scar? <laughs> you know what? Fuck you guys. You guys are a bunch of fat. Oh, shit, dude, run! Wait, who the fuck shot him, dude? One down, three to go. Three hours later. Hey, yo, guys, is it safe to come out now? Guys? Hello? Weezus? Are you there? Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Commentary Blackball. In today's episode, we're going to be talking about someone who's been making the rounds. A former Twitch streamer, gamer, and now a notorious predator. Which, again, he has been making the rounds around the internet's fear for some time now. For doing something that's a big no-no. And that big no-no is no other than, according to him, and funny thing, he's edited this out multiple times to try and make himself look better, talking inappropriately with a minor. Yeah, no kidding, it's so fucking over, bro. Hey, I made it! I did it again! I did it again! <laughs> Herschel Guy BM. God, I probably fucking butchered that. Better known as Dr. Disrespect, aka Doc, is a 42 year old content creator who is banned on Twitch for, according to him, talking to a minor inappropriately. And keep in mind that good old Doc was, at this time, in his late fucking 30s. Now, no one saw this coming, you know, not even his wife at the time. Now, most of you all know this all started when the conversation of Dr. Disrespect's ban was brought up again, which all led up to an ex-Twitch staff named Cody to start schizo ranting saying someone was banned because they were talking to minors and that someone, you know, being very vague on who he was talking about. But let's just say it doesn't take a fucking genius to put one and one together and realize, yeah, no, this guy's definitely talking about him. But before continuing that, let's take a look at Dr. Disrespect and lay out all my issues I have with the guy and just completely shit on him. SD, they give it the $10. It's knock knock. Who's there? The doc coming into another woman. Now, with my vast investigative skills and deductive prowess, I came to the conclusion that Dr. Disrespect was kind of shit. Dr. Disrespect is probably one of, if not the most famous streamer, and fair to say, the tallest streamer online. Like, I swear, he's like Godzilla size or something. Now, he was known for elaborate bits or skits and for playing games like Fortnite, Apex, PUBG, and just every game under the sun, honestly. And basically, his character was just someone who was the gaming champion, the two timer, as he would say. Now, his content was wasn't any clip farming like Sneeko or Jinxie. No, not like any of those retards. It was more organic, but that doesn't mean shit because if I'm being 100%, it was fucking brain rot. Fortnite, 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 Fortnite. Whoa, Doc, what, what are you doing to your crotch, man? There, there's kids watching, bro. Now, good old Doc has been around since the beginning of Twitch, even before Twitch was called Twitch. I mean, the dude's currently in his 40s now. Like, bro's fucking old. But then in June of 2020, Dr. Disrespect was banned off Twitch despite being literally one of the biggest cash cows and back then it was literally up to speculation like no one knew why this dude got his whole career taken away overnight which didn't last long because soon after he would move over to YouTube and at that point people stopped caring well that was the case until of recently I have been with four different women in the last month the wife's not happy but what can I say keep being it Right, thank you, Four years after Doc's ban on June 21st, 2024, a former Twitch employee named Cody Connors and he would tweet out multiple things, ending it off by just plain out saying that Dr. Disrespect was banned for sexting a minor, using Twitch whispers feature out of all things. You know, basically abusing his platform to put it abruptly. And on top of that, he was supposedly trying to meet up with the minor at TwitchCon. And just to put in perspective, the doc would have been in his late fucking 30s. And not to mention, he had a whole daughter and wife. Yes, he had a whole fucking kid and did this shit. But to skip all the bullshit, this would eventually all come to an end. And when Dr. Disrespect himself would come out and basically admit to all of it. Like, what the fuck, man? Son of a You know the biggest difference between me and you, boy? Is that I can fly without a space. Dude, who in the right mind would give anyone this type of budget? Especially an internet influencer. Like, bro is literally playing pretend with his friends. Like, this is the equivalent of playing army men when you're six. Like, dude, no wonder he was into minors. This. Respect. Respect. 
And you're looking at the two time back to back 19. <laughs> Doom must have been so cocky knowing that none of the Twitch staff could legally say anything about his ban. Like, I really do hope just hopefully somebody just sprays this man with a couple bullets. I mean, just imagine keeping your audience in the dark for four whole years just pretending to be a nice man behind the screen. I mean, I should also mention that he planned on meeting with the miner and at fucking TwitchCon out of all places. Like, what was the plan in his head? Keep in mind he was in his late or mid 30s, just casually with a wife and kids and just threw that all away for just some underage boon. Like, is this dude fucking insane? <laughs> So this is truly insane. Now, of course, this Dr. Disrespect situation has been insane. It has baffled the scholars. But what you're about to hear is even more insane. Is this dude fucking stupid or something? His voice is making my fucking ears bleed. <laughs> I made it! I did it again! I did it again! <laughs> I did it again! You know, imagine cheating on your wife with a minor, and this is your fucking reaction. Fucking bouncing up and down like a retard with a chainsaw. He raped someone, he abused an animal on stream, he's running a sex ring, and they have evidence of it. Or, I mean, what can you even get banned on Twitch for? Permanently, too. They have to have like a clip of him doing something on stream or else they wouldn't be doing it like this, so... Fuck. Dude, it's so funny to me that Leafy said all this shit cause... Dude wasn't too far off, honestly. <laughs> it's been 30 minutes, man. Where is this guy? Oh, I'm feeling itchy. Hey man, what's up? You got the stuff? Of course, ma. Alright man, well, lay it out. Alright, well, I should probably warn you. This is some new experimental shit. You know, it's pretty fucked. <laughs> Weezus, did you just take it all? Weezus, you fucking shit me, man. You're so fucked. Look at you. You're so fucked. You took all the drugs. So, what did we learn from today's video? Well, we learned that Twitch is bad, harbors pedophiles, and also what else? Uh, yeah, that's basically it. In conclusion, the lesson is, um, don't be disrespectful. So yeah, um, yeah. Subscribe! It's been so long, guys, I've missed you guys. Please army. Shout out Weezus, the goat, some may say.